Hey guys! I haven't said hey to you guys in like a really long time, so this is really quite exciting. Before I begin talking about the awesome horrific topic of how I became a nerdfighter, I would like to inform Ethan that I am in fact the face of Mondays. So you can just like start tossing my name around at the end of your videos all you want. Now for how I became a nerdfighter. I'd seen one or two Vlogbrothers videos before and thought that they were pretty cool, but this was before I really got into YouTube, so I didn't really consistently watch them and didn't really get into them until about a couple months later. At which point I had already fully dabbled in the art of being a nerd. In fact, I have dabbled in nerdism my entire life. I've always enjoyed sci-fi, I've always enjoyed reading, I've always enjoyed nerdy things, video games, that type of stuff. And once I met my friend Stevie, my nerdiness level just enhanced tenfold. And I must say that this is probably one of the greatest things that happened to me in my life. I was already into Harry Potter before I met her, but it wasn't until I met her and became one of her friends that I learned of Doctor Who and I really, really understood the Vlogbrothers and YouTube and how amazing it is. Without her, I probably wouldn't play Magic the Gathering and I wouldn't be about to get into Dungeons and Dragons and my life would just be full of a lot more fail. So it is entirely Stevie's fault that I became a nerd fighter, and I would not take that back for anything. I am so blessed to be her friend and to have learned all of this nerd fighterly awesome because of her and I just I love it so much. So yeah, like almost every time that I talk about this topic with anything, it's pretty much a big shout out to Stevie. So I'm just gonna leave a link to her channel up here so that you guys can check her out. She's pretty awesome. But yeah, so now you guys know how I became a nerd fighter and now Ethan knows who is on Mondays. I, however, don't know who's on Tuesdays. So whoever you are, I will see your face tomorrow.